There are only a few hundred in the world, so for an American warship to bear your name, you must have left a mark on history. Newest member of the Navy's fleet will be named after Gunnery Sergeant John Bassalone. Bassalone received the Medal of Honor for his heroism during the Battle of Guadalcanal in the Second World War. He was also awarded the Navy Cross for destroying an enemy blockhouse and helping to save a U.S. tank at Iwo Jima. He returned home in 1943 with celebrity status, but begged to return to the war. His now 95-year-old cousin remembers it well. He said he was going back. We didn't, we had a funny feeling in the hut, don't go back, still do war bonds. He said, I hate it. He says, my mind is with my troops, you know. And that's what happened. He went back, I never saw him again. Sergeant Bassalone was killed in action during the invasion of Iwo Jima in 1945. The newest ship to bear his name will hit the Navy's fleet in 2022. A ceremony was also held in San Francisco for the first Navy ship to be named after a gay rights icon. It's the USNS Harvey Milk. Harvey Milk was elected to the San Francisco Board of Supervisors in 1977 and was assassinated a year later. He was the first openly gay, gay elected official in a major American city. Before becoming a public official, Milk hid his sexual orientation in order to enlist in the Navy. The men and women who will one day sail in this ship reflect a nation that embraces the rich diversity of our people, draws strength from inclusion, and honors the service of all who are called to serve. Milk was a Navy diving instructor from 1950 to 1955. He was stationed in San Diego. Mayor Kevin Faulkner also attended the ceremony in San Francisco yesterday, along with Council Member Todd Gloria. Construction on the ship will begin in 2019. It's expected to go into service in 2021. Check 